Hey everybody, this is Joe Jackson. I wanted to shoot a quick video about the flooring. I talked about the coupe a minute ago. A lot of people ask the question, what about flooring? What do I use? A lot of people use, you know, straw or pine shavings. And, you know, if that's all you can do, that's fine. The only thing about those things is they hold in odor, they hold in moisture, um, and you're just asking for a problem with diseases or whatever. You know, a lot of people talk about, you know, putting chickens on different medicines and whatever. I've never had to do it. I've not even, now, it probably a lot of it's because of luck. Uh, I'll, I'll give you that, but I've never lost one chicken to a disease, a chick either, because I keep an eye on what they're doing, watch what they're doing, and I'm able to either A, organically give them something to help them, which I'm gonna be go, going through that through this series, or B, I, I, I keep the variable away from it to where it wouldn't never be an issue. You know, hay and pine shavings is good when they're chicks, but as they start growing up, you know, you need something that's, that's very easy to clean up, that doesn't hold moisture. And here's one of them. You can get it from Tractor Supply. This is a, what's called horse mat. Uh, it's, um, you know, it's three, about a three quarter inch thick rubber. They're pretty heavy. I'd say they're probably 50 pounds, 60 pounds. Um, and you can basically pick up they're probably about $30 at Tractor Supply each, and they come by, it's a three by six. So if your coop's only that big, you just need one. What's cool about them is it's easy to clean up. It's easy to scrape. Just put a shovel, flat shovel down, and scrape it right up, you know, once a week, and throw it in a compost, compost bin. So part of this series as I'm going along here is teaching people the different things that I've learned over the years. I've had chickens a long time back and forth over the years. But here's one important value that I want to show you. So it's so easy to clean it up. On the dirt floor, you can't really clean it up because of you're picking up the dirt, you're wasting away most of the flooring. And by using that, here's my compost bin. If you notice, those are two skids. It's three quarters of the way filled up. There's probably a thousand pounds together of probably manure. You know, I do have 50 something chickens now with the babies and everything. I probably have 90. Um, that's a lot. Um, but what's cool about it is I can either A, sell it, or B, use it for my yard, use it for my, you know, uh, garden. If I decided to use a garden, do a garden. Um, it, the manure is very, very, you know, a lot of people look for that. They actually buy it in the store. So there's a lot of things you could do as that as well. But it's very simple to clean up with that horse mat. Run a shovel, throw it in a wheelbarrow, take it to a bin, and compost it. And basically, you can look up composting. I can go through that as well. But composting is very simple. It's basically manure, a brown item like leaves or whatever, and also a green item like hay or grass clippings or whatever and you level it off as you go and what by doing that it composts basically turns into a nice dirt if that makes sense kind of and when you spread it out the nutrients that's in there because of the chicken manure oh my goodness it's amazing i also have pigeons and a buddy of mine named danny uh has taught me a lot about pigeons i use that manure as well um pigeon manure is very high in the um um a lot of different things nitrogen or whatever that your grass needs so anyway i hope you got something from this if it could help you that's great i'm doing a complete series on how you can make money and the profit of egg sales um also i do some other videos from natural stuff around your house to help with insects or whatever so i hope you grab some value from this if you uh if you see value please subscribe i got a lot more coming hope you have a great day thank you